We better get everyone out of this building before it completely collapses on us. That might kill him. Target still up. Weapons empty. Cannon gate. How did that not? It's <laughs> like duck. Stay low. Hey there everyone, it's Thackard and welcome back to more XCOM Enemy Unknown. So last time we lost two countries, but we did have a successful mission. Now we have some alien abductions, one in Canada and one in Japan. Alright, so Canada is kind of okay, Japan's both kind of, they're both kind of okay. Um, more engineers might be the good thing let me check here because we have several engineers we're currently at 34 we have quite a few engineers do we have any facilities coming up that are going to require like massive numbers of engineers that right 35 engineers for the satellite network so you know what uh yeah we could we could uh get a couple more that'll work well, we will get one and we'll get one at the end of the month but i mean that's that's a, way, a ways away so let's go with this one sapporo sapporo japan um everyone's looking good all right let's do this Okay. Strike one. Prepare for landing. Begin. You'll be heading into Japan for the next mission. We've picked up a local broadcast. Watch it. <clears throat> Central, this is Big Sky. Strike team is touching down now. Roger, Big Sky. Reading you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. There is not a lot of good cover out here, is there? This is all partial, partial, partial. That's full, partial, full, but this is way out here in the middle of nowhere. Partial, partial, partial. Are the building's fallen. That's basically it. Okay. Uh, let's get you to... Go up here. Is that, yeah, that's a restaurant. Put that guy on the roof. All right, so mutons. Enemy in sight. Oh, he's a couple of them are gonna get hit. Blew a hole in the wall. Didn't hit him. The target. Uh, we definitely can get some good shots at him. Oh, that's a rocket target. And I... I mean, that hits both of them, doesn't it? If I hit, want to hit him with a shred... I think I have to hit him with a shredder because... Shredder is slightly larger in range. I thought it had a larger area. Maybe that's something else. Oh, oops. I hit the wrong one. Well, it hit him. And it shredded him. 
I guess I'll use the other one <laughs> at a later point. Take him. Won't kill him. This was the guy I was going to give the other uh, pistol to, and then I didn't do it. Because I'm a dummy. Um, if I did give him the pistol, he could have gone here and he could have taken a shot and he could have killed him. That being said... Ooh. All right, we're gonna we're gonna do something risky. I'm gonna go and try and tase this fool. He's probably gonna fall back. Yeah. All right, out he goes. All right, he's gonna be back there somewhere. We'll try and we'll try and tase him after a bit. Clear to engage. Ooh, we found some more guys. You know what? Uh, I like that setup. He is right here? Right back here. Either way, we're going to blow a hole in this wall. This, this restaurant's just gone. This restaurant's just gone. Alright, where's that other guy at? Can't actually see. Oh, he's over there. I see him. Oh, he 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 took a hit. He took a hit. 65% chance. 96% chance. And get on your back. <laughs> Did you tell my support to duck? Because he probably needed to. 65 is pretty good. Nice. All right, you. Let's get you up to like here. Oh crap. It's not carrying a weapon like the others. This isn't good. Um, Berserker. Okay, our medic's in, in, in trouble. Our sniper, that is, in, in trouble. 53% chance I can probably get a better shot somewhere else. We need to pull this guy back. We need to take out that berserker this turn, but how do I take him out? That might be the best way to do it. Um, let's, we're going to target him. Let's get you uh, inside as well. You still can't hit that guy. Oh, no. Okay. You can. 53% is not that great. Oh, we got him, though.
that pulled them out of cover. Um, and you. Can I do this with one shot? 100% chance it does 7 damage. Up to 7 damage. What's the lowest amount that it can do? That's the problem. If we miss, or we don't kill him here, we're, we're, we're like Dunzos. Um, higher chance if the target's Health is at 3 HP or less. Not going to try it. Um, does up to 7 damage. He has 6. I think we have to use Rapid Fire. We have to make sure he dies. If he dies in the first one, he doesn't take the second shot. Okay. Alright. That worked out. Take a shot at someone, but... Oh no, it's an aid. Ow. <laughs> There's not going to be anything left of this restaurant. You have no cover. There's still a there's we have to remember there's still a muton <laughs> roaming around back there somewhere. Might come up behind us at any moment. Up to seven damage. Shoot him. Alright, that kills him. Put you in a spot where you can cover that. <laughs> there's there's nowhere to stand where they're still building. Um all right, you go there. We better get everyone out of this building before it completely collapses on us. That might kill him. Target still up. Weapons empty. Cannon cage. How did that not? Because <laughs> I duck. Stay low. All right. Um. He has three damage. Uh. Is there any cover over here inside this circle? I mean, it's not going to matter, is it? It's like technically yes, but if we don't sedate him, we're going to have to kill him. Sleep. Is that it? Is that it? All mission objectives. <laughs> Another more guys. Started to panic for a second. It's like, oh no, there are more guys. I'm stuck in the middle of this room. All right, we captured a mutant. That'll work. Which means we also captured the weapon. That's that's even better. Wounded for seven days. All right, so uh, 
In the zone, killing a flanked or uncovered target with a sniper rifle does not cost an action. Kiff. Double tap allows both actions to be used for standard shot, headshot, disabling shot, provided no moves were made. One to turn cooldown. So, if I take a shot, uh, if I don't move, I can take two shots. That's pretty damn strong, too. Unlimited shooting if people are not in cover. That's okay. That is great against floaters because floaters are never in cover. Um, cyber discs are technically never in cover. I mean, I won't kill a cyber disc with this guy unless I'm shooting when he's low, but I could take out floaters. You know, I could take out floaters. But guaranteed two shots no matter what. One turn cooldown. Both of these are so good. I mean, this would be better if I did have disabling shot, but I went for battle scanner. All right, in the future, maybe with that other one we have, who will be a good sniper. We'll go with like uh, headshot, disabling shot. Um, then this that way we have we can do multiple things like that alright so that's how we'll set up the second guy we'll set up this guy within the zone alright combat drugs uh, better smoke better smoke your men certainly seem to have a neck for capturing alien subjects alive. I only hope they Oh yeah, that gives us the grenade. Workers in relation to ours. Please pass on my gratitude to our forces. Gives us grenade and the legit plasma rifle. We will be in touch, commander. All right, so a couple of things. Research, change project, berserker autopsy. The men are calling this beast the Berserker, although it shares the same structure as the Muton. For reasons yet unknown to us, the Berserker seems to be consumed by bloodlust with little regard for its own safety. Combat stints. Um. We, we stewed Muton glands. And, uh. Gives us a bonus of something. Interrogate Muton. There was a chance we could have interrogated the Berserker too, but... Oh, that would have been a risk. <laughs> that would have been such a risk. Plasma and weaponry research credit. Nice. That'd actually be very helpful. Because we were researching Titan armor, but we're going to be researching the plasma rifles very soon. You know what? Do we? Can we equip the one right now that we have? Generally, you can't until you research it, but let's say we take you, load you out. Uh, we can't do it until we get it. So you know what? We will put the delay on the armor. Our armor right now is pretty solid. So we will go with the plasma. Uh, that being said, we do have some things that we want to do. We're going to have to make a... We're going to have to make another generator. We might want to do it as an Illyrium generator. We're starting to get low on power. Um, we can build now the satellite nexus if we had the credit, which we don't. But we can get the credits, I think. Maybe. Might be able to get enough. We need to keep the thin men. 
sell all the mutants. Mmm. Do we need flight computers for building the... We haven't researched the new uh, interceptors yet. Oh, we'll get some more flight computers. This is Central. I'm receiving you. What do you mean you think you saw a snake? What the hell does that have to do with anything? Uh, I th thought they saw a snake. Did you see that? It's, it's, it's a Metal Gear reference. 194. I mean, that's not enough. It's 300. We're not going to be able to do it until after the next mission. Um, unless there is something we can do here. Heavy lasers, 311. Nah, that's not it. My plasma rifles. That's a thousand. Those cost a lot to make. Yeah. Oh. We would have to sell enough to get 400. It's over what we need. I mean, it wouldn't net us 600, but it would also cost us a lot of Illyrium and alloys. So we'll take the pass. Now the foundry. All right. Nope. Just going to have to go with what we got for right now. Impact transfer complete. Contact detected. UFO has landed in Mexico. Send the Skyrim. Hit the button. Let's go. Actually, this episode has gone pretty long, so uh, we will pick this up Drop next time arrived. on our... We'll pick this up next time, and we will do the mission as the first thing for the episode. So, y'all have a wonderful day. That was a pretty solid episode. We have... Berserker, uh, Autopsy, and a Muton Interrogation. So you know what? Not too shabby. See you all later. Goodbye. Thank you very much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel. You guys are what makes this channel grow. So hit that notification bell, and you'll be notified whenever I post something new or go live. And please always remember to bring it no matter what you do.